today I decided to share with you a Ukrainian tradition that we still have in Ukraine. Uh, one week before Eastern. Yeah, one week before Eastern, as some of you might know, a Ukrainian, some Ukrainians and some Russians celebrate Easter one week later than the rest of the world. Um, I don't really know why. This Sunday is called Palm Sunday. Ukrainians that live in the west of Ukraine, religious and uh, full of uh, traditions of uh, our ancestors. I think some of Ukrainians might not even know the meaning, kind, the traditions that they have. Go to church, uh, do sort of like a rituals passing on in generations. Every single tradition in Ukraine has a religious background or explanation. And today, is Palm Sunday. Actually, uh, in Ukraine we call it Willow Sunday. But a translator is translated now according to, I guess, universal stand standards because palm tree and willow tree it's two different trees. On this day, lots of people go into church with um, willow branches. It could be only one or, one or two or one or two branches, not the, pa not the palms, but willow. I guess it has probably geographical explanation because we in Ukraine don't have palm trees. I will add the pictures of the branches that people take to the church so you can, uh, so you can understand how it looks. Uh, people in Ukraine believe that if you have that, uh, this uh, bunch of uh, branches, I guess, you uh, will be uh, protected by, by good spirits uh, during the whole year. You will, be, you will have these uh, branches uh, somewhere near your front door. Your house will be protected from uh, bad people and from bad luck. Next year, people as usually burn this, uh, these branches uh, or throw them in a river people that uh, follow traditions. Uh, some just throw that in a bin, but uh, they have, next year they have a new branch and it's happening every single year. It's always happened one week before Eastern. Ukrainians that are very superstitious, they believe that on this day you can do something and you should, should not do something. as there is some certain rules for each um, holiday. In all times people believe that they can predict a future event of the weather or, or something what might happen in the country by the way nature behaves, uh, by the way animal behaves. So for example if bees uh, fly around they believe that um, spring will come quicker uh, than normal. I must say that Ukrainians that live um, in the west of Ukraine, uh, lots of Ukrainians follow these traditions. Ukrainians they speak probably Ukrainian language that are very patriotic, that love their country, full of tradition of their parents and grandparents. They know these uh, superstitions, they know the rules, what they can do, what they can't do. Uh, there is some general belief that if it's a big church holiday, um, people in villages would never borrow anything from home, would never borrow anything to the neighbor or money or anything like eggs, bread, uh, salt, sugar. Uh, they believe that if you give someone something from your home on this day, you will have a bad luck during the whole year. I know some young people that still do that, but a lot of people and losing understanding or symbolic behind it. They probably don't even understand where it comes from. It can protect the house during the whole year. And palms symbolize a life, freedom, a fight for independence. And um, my guess would be that the people in Ukraine uh, have chosen a willow branches. Uh, willow branches, but one of the first trees that wake up after the winter, and it has it start blossoming. So I guess that's why they decided to have the, exactly that tree. People in Ukraine believe that a willow tree uh, has a magical power, has a strong connection with um, 
nature. People believe this tree uh, has lots of nutrition and they not only make tea from the, when they take in a bath as they drop leaves or a branches in a bath. Um, uh, people that like sauna, when they go to the sauna they have uh, willow branches and they smash themselves with those branches and they believe that um, it makes them healthy. Uh, Ukrainians has a really very strong belief in nature. Um, Ukrainian believes is that they um, that they can take a lot of from nature, and uh, our ancestors knew how to heal different illnesses with the help of nature. They knew if you had some kind of illness, they knew which herbs to combine and how to prepare it so you will be healed. Um, it's usually in a villages. Uh, it's one woman that knew how to do it and she was looking after the whole village. People in the cities nowadays um, just don't know about those traditions anymore and don't really know the recipes of uh, how to help yourself with help chair and how to combine different herbs. It, it, is, it is believed that uh, this tree, uh, it's a woman tree, so if woman has this tree, it can uh, and uh, or she is taking, uh, she is drinking a tea, from the street or taking a bus, she, be, she will become powerful and beautiful. But generally, people in Ukraine and their villages believe that in the, those days, Earth waking up from a winter, start blossom, birds start singing. I personally like this time of the year because uh, everything is sort of like waking up. You can see lots of flowers start uh, growing, trees start blossom, and uh, yeah, it's a pretty nice time of the year. I hope you're well wherever you are and you learned something about Ukrainian tradition and um, who knows maybe you will start following some of Ukrainian traditions yourself and you never know maybe it will bring you luck as well.